Hi, it's Anne. And today I want to explain a little bit about the gift of happiness, what it is, um, by way of an experience I had at a restaurant many years ago, actually, that um, really, they got this principle of the gift of happiness. So the restaurant is called Snooze, and it's, it started out in Denver, Colorado. That's where I went with my sister-in-law who lived out there. And they're known for their gourmet plate size pancakes and with flavors like pineapple upside down pancake and lemon poppy seed pancake. And I think that the day I was there, they had like a s'mores pancake that was just special for that day. So delicious, not healthy, but delicious and soul satisfying. And so we placed our orders and we're sitting at the table. This is me and my family and my sister-in-law and a few minutes later, after we'd sat down, our waitress comes by and says, here, this is for you. And she puts one of these gourmet pancakes on our table. Just a free gift from her, from the restaurant, enjoy. And I was stunned and amazed and it was delicious and we really enjoyed splitting that as our breakfast appetizer. Um, but later I asked, so what, where, what is going on? Do you do this for everybody? I assume not. And she said, no, every day each server gets three free pancakes that they can deliver to anybody they want in the whole restaurant, their choice. And today we just happen to be the lucky ones. And I just thought that's genius because here's the thing about the gift of happiness. One is it feels so good to give people something that is unexpected and delights them and makes their day. But there's something even bigger when you as an organization, you as a leader, you as a store manager, um, empower the people around you to do that giving. You're not only making individual people happy one at a time, you're creating this whole culture of this is just what we do and we are all sort of this team working together to delight people in these small ways and they don't have to be big at all, just teeny. And so I, because of that for their business, I bought their t-shirt. I've been telling everybody and their brother about that restaurant for probably, I don't know, five, six years. Um, and still have positive memories of this place that I went one time. But it also makes me think about what do I do with gift of happiness, this principle in my own life. And part of the way I do this kind of thing is with my um, connection cards. So, so I go around with these cards in my pocket. Um, or in my purse, you know, and they say things like, you are awesome, or you can do this, or you are loved, or you're not alone, you know, whatever, all sorts of different messages that we as human beings like to hear and need to hear from time to time. So on an individual level, I'm empowered to share these messages with whoever. Um, I see more opportunities to give them when I have this thing, this tangible thing to give. And the best times to give them, I'm finding, are when somebody's saying something about, oh, his, his wife is, you know, nine months pregnant and ready to have the baby every, any day now. And it's like, oh, okay, here's a card for you to give to your wife. And so, again, there's this double layer, this trickle of giving. And so my gift to that person is for him, yes, but also for this other person in his life. And it just works so beautifully. So... That's kind of the idea. It's hard to explain in a five-second soundbite, um, but it's really fun and it's really powerful, both as for an individual happiness practice, but also, again, for this sort of how do you build a culture of, of people who just do this for each other and treat each other that way. So if you're intrigued by this idea, like, oh, what would it be like to carry around my own set of cards and see what I could do with those, um, or if you are part of an organization or a leader of an organization where you're sort of thinking about, well, how do we sort of shift our culture or make it even more powerfully a place of giving and delighting either each other or customers or both, um, talk to me, reach out to me. You can order cards on my website and you can also schedule a free 20 minute conversation just to brainstorm a little bit about what, what might gift of happiness look like in your life, in your organization in a way um, that could really make a difference for you and for a lot of people around you. I would love to hear from you. I hope you're having a great day. See you in the next video.